Here's an example um, from your homework on composition of functions, or uh, the name of the section might be combinations of functions. But here we're exploring a composition. Um, the way that this question is asked is maybe a little bit backwards from the typical type of question about composition of functions. Here we're given h of x, so we're given the composition. We're told that h of x is equal to 8 minus, oops, I want to write here, 8 minus 4x squared. Whole thing squared here. And we're being asked for the component functions f and g. And actually, so they're, they're giving us a hint that we're not actually having to de determine both component functions. Uh, we're given that g of x is 8 minus 4x, and we are asked to find um, an f of x so that f composed with g of x gives us 8 minus 4x squared. Now, one thing to note, uh, remember that f composed with oops, g of x, the way this operation works is we take f of that second function, which in this case is g of x. Okay, we were also told in the problem that g of x is equal to 8 minus 4x. So they've already set us up in this problem with g of x equal to the inner function, which is what we want when you look at um, what the composition means here. g is the inside function and f is the outside function. So the inner function in this case is 8 minus 4x. The outer function is the squaring function. What we would need to do to go from f of 8 minus 4x to 8 minus 4x whole thing squared is apply the squaring function. Going from here to here implies that f of x is equal to x squared. Because remember, the way that you evaluate f of anything is when you're given an equation like this, wherever you see an x, you substitute everything that's written inside the parentheses. So we would substitute the whole 8 minus 4x here and then apply that second power. And this would give us h of x. So in this problem, the f of x is equal to x squared. Now, just one last thing I could do here um, to for any students who are still a bit unsure about what's going on here, if maybe it'll help if we verify um, what we came up with. So h of x, this is what we are told. h of x is 8 minus 4x squared. Um, now, we're supposed to write it uh, as a composition, f of g, sorry, I've gotten a bit sloppy there, which is equal to f of g of x. Now, applying um, the functions that we have, g is 8 minus 4x. To apply um, the function f to that, I look at the equation for f up here, and it's x squared, so I take what's in the parentheses and I square it. And so this seems to work.